going on my dudes welcome to the channel i'm quitty bags and today my dudes we are going to be remaking my semi-automatic wheat farm now um i put up a video about uh, let's say like seven weeks ago and um it was making this automatic wheat farm and i've had a lot of um negative um comments on it because the minecraft music was like stupid loud so before we even start if you guys didn't see the video um you guys won't understand but basically the minecraft music was at like 100 percent, and then when i edited it i was like uh screw it i'll just throw it up and then i had a, like a lot of negative um feedback on it like i got a lot of likes on it and i got like twenty one thousand views i think at this point but i'm gonna redo it just to kind of like clarify it and just to like make it more simple and uh if if you're watching this and if you came from that video i'm sorry okay <laughs> the minecraft music is bopping all right so let's get started now before we get started let's see if we can just smash 50 likes on this video maybe maybe 50 likes let's try for 50 likes and also if you're new and if you haven't subbed yet make sure to smash that sub button also hit the bell so you guys don't miss a single tutorial now if you guys have any tutorials you guys want me to go over or do just drop it in the comments and i will look at it and consider it and uh i might just make it and i'll give you a shout out for making the video for you all right my dudes so let's get right into this build now we're gonna go over what you're gonna need for this build you're going to need eight buckets of water now you're gonna actually need eight buckets of water um and this ninth bucket you need um you can refill you're gonna have to refill it like four times but you're gonna need the physical bucket to put inside these dispensers for these eight buckets of water so you're gonna need eight buckets of water you're going to need one hopper you're gonna need one redstone repeater you're gonna need a handful of redstone uh one stone button eight dispensers two chests uh two stacks of 64 dirt um you don't need in total that but it's roughly around that area it's like a stack and a half and roughly three 64s of oak planks or any other type of material you're looking to make this build out of um it's kind of a large scale build like it's a pretty large build so we're just going to go with three stacks roughly and you're going to need eight pieces of glass now you can do any color that you want to do and obviously you're going to need a ton of seeds my dudes i think you're going to need more than yeah you're going to need more than 64 but you get the point and obviously you're going to need a hoe all right so first things first we're going to grab all our oak and we're going to grab our dirt oh i grabbed coarse dirt there Uh oh whatever we'll switch that out later um and you're gonna need your glass and your hopper and your chest let's grab those to start now let's start by putting the chest like that and you're gonna go behind the chest and you're gonna make sure you crouch and right click so then the hopper is actually attached to this chest make sure it's like that or else when your seeds come down it's not gonna go in the hopper my dudes all right now you're gonna take your wood and you're gonna count eight blocks backwards from this chest so one two three four five six seven eight then you're gonna come over to this side on the left side of the build and put two pieces of wood like that now you're gonna take your eight pieces of any type of glass you wanted and you're gonna count eight backwards from on top of the chest so one two three four five six seven eight just like that now you're gonna take seven pieces of wood and you're gonna go seven back from this hopper so one two three four five six seven that way it's lined up with the glass right here and you're also gonna fill in these two extra i forgot so all the way till the end now we're gonna take our dirt and we're gonna put it here and we're gonna actually climb one up so that dirt doesn't matter down there and we're gonna go all the way across we're gonna count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we're lined up with the gla glass. Uh, now you're gonna make sure you wanna hold crouch and you're gonna count seven back. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, so this is gonna make it an eight by eight field once it's filled in. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now fill this into a square like this. Boom. And then uh, fill in the center. All right, so your build should look like this so far, my dudes. Now we're gonna go to the back of the build and we're gonna put one dirt block there and then put one on top. And now we're gonna build an actual seven by eight field so we're gonna go back from here we're gonna count this counts as one two three 
four, five, six, seven. So this should be seven long. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, now we're gonna go eight across. And we're gonna fill this square in now, just like we did with the other field. All right, now that you have both fields done, one should be an eight by eight and one should be a seven by eight. The bottom should be eight by eight, the top should be seven by eight. Now you're gonna take your wood over here and we are basically gonna make a trench so the water can keep the field hydrated. So just like this, we're gonna fill in one block below the dirt. So it should look exactly like this and then we're gonna go do that to the other side now as well. So we're gonna go back here and fill this in. Just like this, my dudes. Now we're gonna fill in this side so water can actually stay in this trench so it doesn't leak out the sides. So we're gonna go up like this, jump up here and grab more wood and fill in like that. So now when we come over here, as you can see, the water is actually gonna flow all the way to the end here. And then make sure to cover in this L shape over here beside the glass, fill that in. Then also we're going to put a block right here to divide the water stream so this water doesn't get mixed with that water. Now let's come to our opposite side here and we're going to put our wall up as well. So we're going to go back like this. And we're going to put a wall so then our water does not leak out the sides. Okay, boom, we have it. Now we're gonna put a back on it. You're gonna make uh, wood planks on the back here like that. So now all the areas are filled in. So our water will not leak out the sides. Now we're gonna fill in this side like that. Uh, you don't need to put this block here. This is just so I can jump up. I'm doing this in survival mode so it's easy for you guys to follow. Now let's go ahead and go grab our buckets of water. So we need one, two, three, four right now. Now these are the refillable buckets. You do, you just need to put one here. So that way when all your items come down, the, uh, the stream will actually take your wheat and seeds or carrots, potatoes, beans, whatever you got growing. There's no beans, but anyways, it'll take it and put it down into that hopper and go into the chest. And then you're also going to put a water bucket here and right here. And then we need two more for this side right here and this side right here. All right, so now all your water should be flowing like this. All right, next thing we're going to do is we're going to create a wall on top of the water. So that way our seeds and stuff like that isn't actually getting in here. Um, we can delete this block. And you're going to make it come all the way to the end like that. You're going to do the same to the other side. Just come all the way down here. And now your water is fully enclosed, my dudes. Now we're actually going to build the walls too high. So you're going to go up one level like this. That way nothing spills out. We're going too high for every wall now. All right, now we're gonna go grab our dispensers. Redstone, redstone repeater, and uh, your stone button. Any type of button works. All right, so you're gonna wanna put your dispensers lined up like this. You should have eight of them. All right, now you're gonna go behind the dispensers and you're gonna lay down some of your planks all behind eight of them like this. And then you're gonna put wood over top of your dispensers. Whoops, don't get caught in it like that. And then now you're gonna take your redstone and lay it down like this behind all your dispensers. And you're gonna create a path like this. Then we can get the redstone all the way to the front. Now you're gonna delete this brick up here. 
block, I should say. But redstone, but a button. Now, redstone only travels 14. I believe it's 14 pieces. Power can only travel through redstone for 14. So we're going to need to put a repeater like right here, about midsection. So that way, the power travels all the way to the dispensers. Now we're going to grab our water buckets. Um, you're going to need to fill up all eight water buckets. All right, now that you got your eight water buckets, place one in each dispenser. Okay, so your dispenser should be full of water now. Now if you want, um, just to make it look nicer, let's put a, uh, let's put a uh, piece, piece of wood on each side there. All right, my dudes. So I went ahead and planted the whole field, and I'm going to show you guys how this works now. You're basically just going to hit the button like this. Bing, bada, boom. And the water is going to take over the whole field, dumping all the seeds and, you know, obviously wheat if uh, it was fully grown into the chest there. And then you can click the button again, and the water is going to withdraw. And now we're going to look in our chest, and bing, bada, boom. There you go. We got all our wheat seeds in there. Now, remember, this works for either carrots, potatoes, beetroots, or wheat um, I'm thinking I think that's it no melons no pumpkins stuff like that only things that can be uh, trampled by water all right my dude so that is gonna be it this was a remake of my original minecraft 1.15 easy wheat farm tutorial now um, this was just a remake video I just wanted to correct it because the music volume was terribly high so I hope you guys enjoyed this one it was super easy to make and uh, yeah enjoy it go try it out for yourself peace out my dudes let's see if we can smash 50 likes on this video and uh, don't forget to hit that sub button and also hit that bell so you don't miss a single tutorial. And also, like I said before, drop a comment and let me know what you want me to build next. And I'll build it and give you a shout out. All right, my dudes. Peace out and have an epic day.